guys welcome back to my channel today we are doing a tutorial on these braided stitch bracelets a lot of you guys have been requesting these so here it is also check out the description for a couple of announcements and all my social medias let's just get into the video so to make this bracelet you're going to need some embroidery floss um, and you're gonna pick out three colors that you want to use I'm using purple teal and pink you will need to cut three strings of each color I do mine the length of my arm to the center of my chest. So I just take my thread and hold it in one hand and extend my arm out and then bring the string to the center of my chest and then cut it there and I do this three times for each of your three colors. And you can start this however you want. I'm gonna braid mine so I can make it adjustable. So I just tied a knot then braided it and then tied another knot and now we're gonna start our bracelet. You're going to want to separate all of your strings so that they are just grouped together like this. You can start on either side, but I'm going to start on the left side. And to start this off, I'm going to only focus on my first two sections of color. So this pink, I'm just going to put to the side. We're not going to worry about this. I'm just going to focus on the blue and the purple. Taking this very outer string here and then my second blue string, I'm going to cross the outer string over top to make a four. Take this little tail, wrap it underneath the second string, and then pull this to the top, and then do it twice. I'm going to repeat that step on my other blue string. And then I'm also going to do the same step on all three of my purple strings. Now we're going to go back to our new outer blue string and I'm going to do these forward knots on the rest of my blue strings as well as the rest of my purples but not on this blue string that I just did the knots with. So I just took my second blue string and did forward knots on my final blue string and then my three purple strings, but I'm not going to connect these two blue strings that I already did knots with. Then finally, I'm going to take my last blue string and just do forward knots on these three purple strings and not doing them on these blue strings here. Now, to do the other side of the bracelet, we're going to only focus on these two colors and not on the purple. So I'm going to just put that to the side. And I'm going to start with the pink. And I'm going to take this outer pink string, cross it over top of the second pink string to make a backwards four shape. Wrap the tail underneath and pull it through and then pull it to the top, doing it twice. I'm going to continue to do backward knots on the other pink string and then my three blues. I'm going to set this pink string aside, take my next outer pink string, I'm going to do a backward knot on this last pink string and then my three blues. Gonna set this next pink string aside and then taking my final pink string, I'm gonna do backward knots on all of these blues. All right, now I'm going to start over from step one. So I'm going to only focus on my first two sets of color and set this blue string, these blue strings aside. I'm going to take my very outer purple string and make forward knots across my other two purples as well as the three pink strings. I'm going to set that purple string aside and then use my new outer purple string to do forward knots across my last purple string and then my three pinks. 
I'm gonna set this purple string aside and then finally take my last purple string and do forward knots on all three of my pinks. Then finally, I'm going to focus on this side of the bracelet now and only focus on these two sets of color. So I'm gonna set my pink strings aside, take my blue strings and I'm gonna do backward knots with my first blue string on my other two blues and then my three purples. I'm gonna set this blue string aside and then take my outer blue string and do backward knots on this last blue string and then my three purples. I'm gonna set this last blue string aside and take my final blue string on the outside of the bracelet and do three backward knots on these last three purples. And yeah, that is how you do this braided stitch pattern. It's very simple and I hope you guys like it. Also guys, I didn't really say in the video, but to end it, I just did more braid so that I can make it adjustable. Um, if you didn't do the braids though, you could just tie a knot and like leave some excess string hanging off so that you can tie it around your wrist or add a button whatever you want to do. I have a video on how to start and end bracelets, so if you're confused, go watch that. Okay. Alrighty guys, that was the tutorial. I hope this was helpful for you, and I hope you make some really cute bracelets. Thank you all for watching, and leave any video suggestions down below so I know what you guys want to see, and I love you all. Bye!